10 breathing techniques to beat stress. We're always looking for strategies to reduce stress in our daily lives. Have you ever tried using deep breathing techniques? These can be done anywhere, anytime. They also naturally influence your body's stress response, helping to calm you and relax your nervous system. Deep Breathing 101. Let's start off by learning how to breathe deeply. Start sitting or lying flat on your back. Do what feels most comfortable. Completely empty your belly and chest on your next exhale. Place one hand on your chest and one hand on your belly. Then take a deep breath in through your nose, filling up your chest and belly. Pause, then exhale through your mouth again, completely emptying the belly and chest. Try this a few times to get the hang of it. Most of these breathing techniques use this general concept with a few extra processes or methods. Types of breathing exercises. The 478 breathing method. Inhale through your nose for four seconds. Hold your breath for seven seconds. Exhale completely through your mouth for eight seconds. This technique is great for relaxation, helping you ease into sleep or de-stressing in the middle of a busy day. The pursed lip breathing method. Like other breathing techniques, this one will help you slow down your breathing. In turn, physiologically, this should help you relax. Inhale slowly through the nose and exhale through pursed lips as if blowing through a straw. Repeat until you feel calm and relaxed. The alternate nostril breathing method. This is a common practice in yoga for balance and calm but it can also be useful in your everyday life. Close off one nostril with a finger. Inhale through the other nostril. Then close it and exhale through the alternate nostril. Repeat until you start to feel calm, usually about four to five times at least. The box breathing method Navy SEALs use this breathing technique for calmness and focus in high stress situations. It's called box breathing because it can help to imagine an actual box. Start with one side and count to four while you inhale. Then move to the next side while you hold your breath for a count of four. Continue to the next side and exhale to a count of four. Then hold again to a count of four. The lion's breath method. This one might feel strange at first, but it does work. Lion's breath can even help you sleep better, improve lung capacity and enhance mindfulness. Here's how to do it. Inhale through the nose then exhale forcefully through the mouth while making a ha sound and stretching your mouth wide open. This can relieve tension in your chest and face. Resonant or coherent breathing method. Breathe at a rate of five full breaths per minute, inhales and exhales, each lasting about six seconds. This technique helps balance your nervous system if you have a Fitbit or other health data tracker, 
You might even see improvements in your heart rate over time as you practice this one more regularly. The equal breathing method. This technique is all about inhaling and exhaling at the same pace. Inhale for a count of four, then exhale for a count of four. This technique can also be good for improving focus. The Brahmari Pranayama or B breath method. This is a great one for reducing anxiety and easing tension, especially around the forehead. Start by closing your ears with your fingers, inhale, and then hum like a bee during the exhalation. Repeat until you feel calm. Boteco breathing method. This can be a great one if you're struggling to control your breath. Like if you're prone to hyperventilation or respiratory issues like asthma. For this breathing technique, focus on slow, shallow breathing through the nose with a slight pause after each exhale. Repeat this slow process for at least a few minutes or until you begin to feel calm. The physiological sigh. For this breathing method, take two inhales followed by an extended exhale. For the second inhale, try to pull in as much air as you possibly can. Then, as you exhale, you can sigh, extending it as long as possible. Repeat this technique until you begin to feel calm, at least a few rounds. Which breathing technique is right for you? This will depend on what works best for you and which methods you prefer. It may also depend on your specific complaints when it comes to stress and breathing. The best thing you can do is give them all a try and see what works best. From there, you can stick with the one that comes naturally or even the one you remember best. <laughs>